Hello everyone. Happy Sunday. Um, it's raining here and we're supposed to get snow and uh, in the north woods today so it's a good day to stay in and do crafting and um, do videos. Today I want to show you um, something that I bought for my organizational purposes except that I just wanted it. I really didn't need it but how many things do we buy that we really really need? Um, this is called a Midori notebook, Midori Traveler's Notebook. And um, it comes so that you can customize it. And um, I like to sketch when I'm out. I also like to write notes when I go places or maybe watching YouTubes, um, collect quotes, um, write down lists for what I need to do or projects or uh, goals. So um, I don't like to write those things down in my sketchbook because I like to sketch in my sketchbook. So I found a way to have all three of those things um, encompassed in one book that I can um, mix and match at will and carry everything that I need, almost everything. So this is the Midori. It comes... Um, like this with an elastic band to hold everything together and it comes with one notebook that's blank and uh, it's made in the notebooks are made in Japan and they're just beautiful beautiful paper and I'll show you um, I wanted to uh, put some extra things on my notebook so I got a, a Celtic charm and I also put a little um, charm on the bookmark that comes with the uh, system and I made some chunky charms this year for Christmas and I made myself one so this is a Tim Holtz clasp and I put it around um, this little round thing here this holds the elastic band system together to hold your notebooks into in the um, leather and so I just hook the uh, Tim Holtz swivel clasp on there and um, I started adding things to my chain little charms, a crown, um, a sister's charm, a little angel playing an instrument, a shamrock for being Irish and then a beautiful uh, glass um, bead that I got from uh, Joann's and so I thought that was nice and it's not too heavy that it's going to be bothering me when I'm trying to sketch or write. So it's just the perfect addition for that. Now let's see what's inside of here. This is beautiful, beautiful leather and um, very, very soft. They, they um, did something to the edges to finish them. And so first of all, here's a zippered pocket and um, the Midori Traveler's notebook is um, more long, pretty long and thin. It's about like eight and a half by maybe four and a half wide. So it fits, what's nice is that it fits some pencils and pens. So what I put in here is a circle template. When I'm drawing people I like to get the eyes perfectly round so I use that. This a lot really helps me and um, I like to click stamps so I've got those in here some post-its, a couple of paper clips, a um, mechanical pencil you don't have to ever worry about having a sharp pencil with an eraser I use this a lot and um, a micron pen these are water uh, waterproof so you can write and then put down uh, water media over it and they won't smear. And they're very nice. I do watercolor washes and things over my, my um, drawings. Alright, so this is the notebook that it came with. It comes with a craft um, cover, cardstock cover that's real nice and thick. Most people keep these and put them in a, a holder after they finish and put the dates and stuff and they also decorate it, which that's what I'm going to do. I just put a little bit of Celtic paper there. 
and then I put it's got a nice title page I put a stamp and what I want to use this for is lists to do lists or goal lists and then I can um, keep track of what I'm going to do or what I would like to do for the week as you can see the the paper does not bleed through to the other side I typically use a um, rollerball pen from Levenger's. This is the my favorite pen. I love these. These are called True Writers. And I got this one for Christmas. It's pretty red and I love to use them. So that's what I'm carrying with that. So that was the one that comes with it. Then you can purchase other things um, by itself. Since I wasn't too interested in a date book because I use that on my phone. Um, I wanted some line paper to take notes when I'm um, watching YouTubes um, and, or uh, taking online classes. Right now I'm in sketchbook school so here's my notes for that. That's from Danny Gregory if anybody wants to um, join or learn how to keep a um, art journal sketchbook so I'm taking notes on that and I plan on using this for quotes and and uh, just whatever thoughts that I might have uh, I like to keep a binder clip uh, for my painting so that I can um, you know separate my pages really well and lastly or this is the last book that I have is my sketchbook and I decorated this with some uh, stamps this weekend and um, oh this is not the book this is a a uh, craft file and I can keep papers here business cards and that is another addition and you put push it through and um, they have has little pockets here and here's my business cards for my work so you just push that through and then this is the sketchbook it comes it's not a craft paper cover it's a plain cover I suppose they felt that the people that wanted to sketch would would decorate it and that's what I'm gonna do I've got uh, a couple of stamps there and, and a quote and then here's the title page and I put the date I started it and and then when I finish it it'll be that date Here's a, a sketch in pencil. It takes pencil very well. A uh, little, no smudging on the other side. So I'm very happy about that because I like to do both pages. The only thing I'm not happy about is that they have the sketch. The sketchbooks are perforated. So I don't know. They got to get with the program because everybody that I know that that does sketchbook journaling. Um, doesn't rip out their pages. They keep them all together. So I don't know what that is. And um, I I will probably make my own little um, books out of uh, paper. I like to use too. I could put uh, I could make one very easily out of watercolor paper and keep this in here. So then if I'm working on what media, I just take my little um, binder clips to hold my pages down or if I'm in a windy situation and I can hold my pages down and and work that way also if I want to get really crazy with my paint this these books are very easy to remove with the uh, rubber band system you can take them totally out of the book and um, so that you don't get your uh, beautiful leather dirty or full of paint um, and work in the book and then put it back in and that that's it but this is what I like to do I like to um, draw and journal about my day or about what I'm thinking about um, this is was done with uh, gouache uh, a light wash of gouache and uh, same thing with this and done with a brush pen and then this was done with the little micron same thing with this and um, I wanted to write about my day uh, my granddaughter's birthday cake also done in gouache I don't know I've been into gouache lately and uh, I wrote about a little bit about what um, her day was I gotta decorate this page a little bit more and then I saw the first robin on our um, in front of my office for the season and that was on uh, April 10th so 
spring is quite quite a bit late this year so I want to paint this today probably tonight and decorate it up a little bit but uh, I love to do this I see things out in nature and I try to um, uh, draw them um, as quickly as possible and just to record you know like the different things that um, happen during the se different seasons so the um, I've got a lot to fill up here and I plan on keeping these as well as the other um, two journals but as you can see once this is filled up I can go and get another one and put it right in there and I still if I don't fill up these I can still keep them all together so that's my little um, Midori uh, Traveler's Notebook and um, I just love it and I plan on using it very very much so I hope you found this interesting or if you're looking for um, you know some something like this that you'll try this out I bought this from um, Bomb Kuchum I'm sure I, I uh, destroyed the name but the pronunciation of the name but I will put a link below to um, where I got it and they have all sorts of other goodies there um, for you to look at and you know possibly buy and um, I'm not affiliated with them at whatsoever that's just where I got mine and um, and I hope everyone has a lovely day and you get a chance to go out and sketch something too bye bye now